Creators rely on tools that make their projects easier, and few machines have become as useful as today's 3D printers. They may not look as bold as laser cutters or industrial machines, but they've earned a permanent place in workshops, classrooms, and hobby desks because of how quickly they turn ideas into real objects. In this video, we're going through the top 6 3D printers of 2026, their key features, and what to consider before choosing one. Links to every product are in the description below. Number 6. ELE Duo Saturn IV Ultra 16K Anyone focused on detail-heavy models, miniatures, or intricate prototypes will appreciate what this machine can do, especially if high-resolution resin prints are a priority. The Saturn IV Ultra 16K is centered around an ultra-sharp 16K monochrome screen that brings out extremely fine textures, crisp corners, and smooth curves that step much closer to cast-quality surfaces. Its build volume is large enough for medium figures or group batches, giving creators room to print multiple pieces at once without sacrificing clarity. The internal light source is arranged to provide even exposure across the entire print area, helping reduce common resin inconsistencies. A refined cooling setup keeps temperatures stable during longer projects, supporting steady output during multi-hour sessions. The printer's interface is straightforward with a menu layout that makes selecting files, adjusting exposure times, and managing batches feel simple even for users still learning resin workflows. Resin printing does come with its usual trade-offs like higher material cost and the need for ventilation during use, and build speeds remain slower than FDM printers. But for creators who want extreme detail and predictable results, the Saturn IV Ultra 16K stands out as a strong choice for resin-based projects. Number 5. Creality K1 Southeast 2024 version Makers who want a fast, reliable FEM printer without jumping into premium pricing will find a lot to like here, especially if they're working on larger models or small production runs. The K1 Southeast 2024 version brings a refreshed motion system that allows noticeably quicker travel speeds, helping shorten long print jobs while still keeping layers neat and consistent. Its build volume offers enough room for helmets, props, mechanical parts, or batches of smaller prints, giving users plenty of flexibility in everyday projects. Creality added simplified calibration features that make setup feel far less intimidating, and the auto bed leveling routine keeps prints consistent across the entire surface. The direct drive extruder supports a variety of common filament types, maintaining steady flow for cleaner walls and stronger structural layers. Noise levels may be noticeable during long high-speed runs and print quality doesn't quite match the refinement of premium flagship models. The machine's footprint also requires a bit of workspace, even so, the K1 Southeast 2024 version lands comfortably at number 5 for its blend of speed, accessibility, and large format capability that suits beginners and returning makers alike. Number 4. Bamboo Lab A1 Mini Combo Creators who want a compact printer that still feels smart, capable, and surprisingly polished will find this model fits neatly onto almost any desk. The A1 Mini Combo brings together a small footprint with tight, reliable performance that's ideal for hobby work, classrooms, or anyone who values convenience over sheer size. Its build volume is modest, but the machine makes excellent use of it with a motion system built for quick, precise movements that help prints come out clean and sharply defined. This combo package includes smart features such as automated filament handling, smooth app integration, and real-time monitoring, which makes the workflow feel more approachable. The direct drive extruder handles typical filaments well, keeping straining under control and providing steady extrusion during longer jobs. Because of its smaller build area, large props or oversized functional parts won't fit without slicing them into multiple segments. The compact frame can also introduce some noise when running at higher speeds. Still, the one mini combo earns its spot at number 4 by delivering a well-rounded balance of print quality, user-friendly features, and dependable day-to-day -day performance in a size that fits practically anywhere. Number 3. Anycubic Cobra S1 Combo Makers who want a feature-rich setup without moving into full professional territory usually find this combo package appealing, especially if they're working on a mix of decorative prints, functional parts, or multi-material projects. The Cobra S1 combo offers a generous build volume that gives users room for larger creations while maintaining enough rigidity in the frame to keep layer lines tight and predictable. Its direct drive extruder supports flexible and higher temperature materials, allowing creators to explore more advanced filaments with fewer feeding issues. A magnetic flexible plate makes part removal straightforward, and the assisted leveling system helps maintain a consistent first layer across multiple print sessions. The combo package often includes upgraded accessories such as additional nozzles, improved spool handling or enclosure support, making it easier to get started without buying add-ons separately. Print speeds are solid for its class, though very large pieces may still take time, and the machine's frame can produce mild vibration noise at higher speeds. 
Its footprint is also bigger than compact models, so it needs open workspace. Even with those considerations, the Cobra's one combo earns its number three position for offering strong performance, versatility, and a ready-to-go bundle that suits ambitious hobbyists and growing makerspaces. Number two, Creality K2 Plus Combo. Anyone looking to step into larger, more demanding projects will appreciate how this machine handles size, speed, and stability all at once. The K2 Plus combo is built around an expanded build volume that gives makers enough room for full-scale props, structural prototypes, or several smaller parts printed together. Its upgraded motion system, supported by linear rails and a reinforced frame, keeps the printer steady during fast movements, helping layers land cleanly even when running complex geometries or tall models. The direct drive extruder and high temperature hot end open the door to tougher materials like nylon blends, PC, or reinforced filaments, allowing users to tackle prints that go beyond standard PLA or PETG. An enclosed design helps regulate temperature during long sessions, improving reliability for challenging materials and reducing the chance of warping. This model does require a dedicated workspace due to its size and overall cost is higher than mid-range machines. Maintenance may also be a bit more involved for newcomers. Even so, the K2 Plus combo ranks at number two because it delivers near professional capability with impressive volume, dependable speed, and the flexibility needed for serious project work. Number one, Prusa Core One. Creators who want dependable, professional-grade output without needing an industrial machine often end up looking at this model first. The Prusa Core 1 is designed around a refined Core XY architecture that keeps movements fast, accurate, and remarkably stable, giving prints clean edges and consistent layer adhesion, even during long, intricate builds. Its build volume strikes a strong balance, large enough for functional parts, detailed prototypes, and multi-piece assemblies, yet compact enough to fit on a typical workshop table or studio desk. The extruder system supports a wide range of materials, including high temperature and reinforced filaments, letting users explore everything from simple PLA to more technical blends used in small business environments. Its automatic calibration, filament sensors, and integrated mesh leveling take much of the guesswork out of setup, especially for makers running frequent or back-to-back -back projects. A modular design allows upgrades such as alternate nozzles, multi-material add-ons, or extended support accessories, helping users grow the machine as their projects expand. It does come at a higher price, and the build can feel like more machine than a casual hobbyist truly needs. Still, the Core 1 earns its number one position through its reliability, print quality, ecosystem support, and long-term usability that fits both serious makers and small production environments. That wraps up our look at the six 3D printers that stand out for creativity, precision, and day-to-day -day reliability. Each one brings something different to the table, whether you need more speed, a bigger build area, or a smarter workflow that keeps your projects moving. If this guide helped you narrow down your choices, go ahead and give the video a thumbs up. Let us know in the comments which printer you're leaning toward. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.